Praise the Lord and good morning to you, dearly beloved. Once again, this is the day that the Lord has made. A day of joy, a day of happiness, a day of his favor and his glory. I want you to understand that Jesus still loves you. He cares for you so much. You are not afterthoughts. The Lord intentionally and wonderfully created you for his purpose and for his favor. And so always see yourself as somebody special and don't think that you are nobody. If you don't know Jesus Christ, then you may think you are nobody. As long as you are in Christ Jesus, know that it took the life of the Son of God for our life to be. So enjoy and believe that God is with you. I know and what I mean by it is that we be who we say. Any pain in our, any idea in our kutiawa, we are not going to do. We should not do. Or Daniel did it. And now we are ready. Jesus Christ is for the book of Sia or boy. And until we are obia, we are not going to do. In the book of Psalm 21, verse 2, I want you to know that God is speaking prophetically to you. So. Where there is a need for you to put your name, put your name there. And let this be a prayer for you. Trust in this prayer and trust in the word of God. Touch it because God is going to use this to be a blessing, a miracle, and a favor unto you. Shall we go through it? He said, you have given him his heart's desire and have not withheld the request of his mouth. For you meet him with the blessings of goodness. You set a crown of pure gold upon his head. He asked life from you and you gave it to him. Length of days forever and ever. His glory is great in your salvation. Honor and majesty you have placed upon him. For you have made him most blessed. You have made him exceedingly glad in your presence for the king trusted in the Lord and through the mercies of the Most High he shall not be moved. Praise the name of the Lord. Just as I said, just take this as a prayer to you. The word of God says, God will answer you and give you all what is your heart desire. And he will not withhold your prayer, the request of your mouth. And he said, God will meet you with the blessings of goodness. And he said, he will set a crown. God has set a crown, a golden one indeed, pure gold upon your head. That is the favor of God. That is the glory of God. So this morning, just say to yourself, my prayer and my request have been heard from the throne of God and God has answered my prayer and he has crowned me with beauty and his goodness. That is gold crown. Continue to believe and trust that he said he asked for long life and you gave unto him. So I speak to you, the Bible says that long life will he satisfy you and so you will not die because your heart desire that you will live long to the glory of God. And so the psalmist say that, yes, you asked for long life and God has granted unto you a lengthy of this with goodness. So remember one thing for sure that this morning your prayer indeed, it has been answered according to the word. And what I love so much, the verse 7 said, the king, that is you, trusted in the Lord. And through the mercies of the Most High, you shall not be moved. Shalom. Peace. And the baby is a kind of drum, a drum, no back, a free new moon, me no echo. Make sure you be king, kind ho. Now we know when you come say. Now what the nakuma so adi amano. Now we are far in the past. I wanna know no so ends and coming on. Now. Or the insurani ye dear and a man on a fade dear or the a chum a yep a cigar call and a day atunitreso. 
obisa na nkwa na ode ma no na natenten a ewo hoda na onyame dia ma no na nani mo nyam ayekese ewo ne nkwa jie mu na wose ani mo nyam ani tumedie ani aho den na urade ede ato no so na enchie mu nso okwa vrem do se na ohene no eji onyankopon di na urade nam na hu mobro so a oso so he no wa ma na ni mo nwe ase we ni mpae bo a ye wo dia yesu di amen